much. Well, the holiday season is in full swing and with it comes the cookie tins, the wrapping paper, the Christmas lights and a whole bunch of items that find their way into the trash. However, it can be a little bit confusing to know what you can and cannot recycle versus what needs to go in the garbage. So to help us recycle properly this holiday season and to help reduce that food waste as well, we have Samantha Yeager here this morning. She is the solid waste superintendent for the city of Columbia. Good morning, Samantha. How are you? Well, thank you for having me here this morning. Absolutely. And you came prepared. Yes, we do have some show and tell this morning. I, hey, I'm always down for show and tell. <laughs> so we got a couple of things here on this table for a yes and a no. So let's go ahead and start over closest to you. This is a big old no. no. Sure, absolutely. This is our no pile. So okay. anytime during the holidays, we see a 23 to 45 percent increase in our waste. Mm. And that's just, you know, the holiday of spirit, gift giving, more parties, more food waste. So our typical gift giving, you know, comes mm. with packaging. Yeah. And we see tinsel, we see bows, we see wrapping paper, we see tissue paper. All of this actually belongs in your garbage cart. As much as we want to recycle, we have to keep our contamination low. Mm. So contamination kind of stops the recycling process. Mm. So what we want to do is we want to stick to your list. Every local municipality or government is different, so stick to that list. Yes. And you can check that on DHEC website. They have a Recycle Here SC location. So if you don't know who services you or what can and cannot be recycled, check that list twice. Okay. So we also see electronics and holiday lights. Yeah. yeah. That's what I get right so. now. I literally put on my lights and I noticed it was broken <laughs> and we didn't know what to do with it. Yes, so you can actually recycle your holiday lights okay. in the e-waste. So mm -hmm. electronic recycling waste, uh, usually counties have drop-off sites. Mm -hmm. The City of Columbia provides a drop-off site at our public works facility every day of the week. Mm -hmm. So even though there's one light out, we can still find a new home for it. Replacement, and replacement there. yes. Okay, so that's yes. in the no pile, but then mm -hmm. we got stuff that we can kind of reuse yes. as well. So when we go back to our three R's that we learned, re reduce, reuse, recycle. Yes. So we do have good things that we can recycle, like our holiday cards. Mm -hmm. So if you have some maybe metallic inside the envelope, that should go in the garbage. The okay. metallics just kind of mess up the paper stream, or we have the age old bag. Right. Uh, my grandmother used to have a closet full of bags that we <laughs> yes. would just reuse and reuse and reuse. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, we can have another option to have an actual reusable bag. Um, you know, doesn't have to recycle a little yeah. bit thicker. You can take that to the grocery store or you can you know, carry your gym clothes or whatever it may be mm -hmm. in those reusable bags. Okay. So we also think about rethinking our waste yeah. and maybe rethinking the way we give gifts. So instead of, you know, maybe an item or a, a, a little Cersei, right. maybe give the gift of an experience, maybe a cooking oh, class or, you know, weekend getaway yeah. or something that your friend or family wanted to do something, but they just didn't you know, yeah. want to spend it on themselves. Yeah. Do that for them instead of having another item on the shelf to collect this. Now you mentioned cooking. Let's really quickly talk about food waste. Yes, so food waste is the number one thing going into our landfills. Mm. So about 40% of food that's generated nationwide is actually not even eaten wow. or touched. It heads right to the landfill. So we can reduce that waste mm -hmm. by uh, if you're having a holiday get together, shop at home before you go shopping at the grocery store. Make sure you have the ingredients you need and you're not over buying. Right. Uh, tell your guests to BYOT, bring your own Tupperware hey. so they can go home with leftovers. <laughs> and then the best, you know, if you do have leftovers that you can donate, donate to those in need as well. See, that's incredibly important as well. It's always important to always, to give back so it doesn't go straight into our exactly. landfills. I yes. love that. Samantha, thank you so much for stopping by this you're morning. Now I know what to do with these Christmas lights, okay? <laughs> One bulb is not going to cut it with us. <laughs>